TS-590 from Kenwood. You know, I have no idea. Like I said, it's their... This is a full wide no open filtering configuration. Automatic gain control that. set to fast. They were considering getting rid of the no fault insurance altogether. And I was really well, let's listen to the same that signal that on the AC-1200. Auto gain control is still set to fast. Filter is wide open. Narrowing the filter down. One of my boys, when the oldest boy first got his license, I think he was $350 a month as a new driver. the neutral setting. Noise reduction is off. Now we'll go back to the Kenwood. You know, you, you drive uh, a couple of years without an accident. You've done bought several cars uh, with what you pay for your insurance. It's, and we, like I said, we've tried them all. You know, progressives and uh, from. Let's Liberty try the noise Mutual reduction. All, all kinds of different companies. We were with Liberty Mutual for a few years. And uh, then they started increasing theirs a little bit here, a little bit there. And uh, they said it was a Michigan speed change. So we got a slightly uh, lower quote at uh, Progressive. Been with them for a couple of years now. And uh, you know, thankfully the speed theirs has not risen up any, but always seems to go up, you know, never goes down. And we've got adjustable settings on both the Yesu and the Kenwood for the processing and the noise reduction. So let me yeah. go over here and get ready to set that. You, you thinking like uh, USAA or something? Now we're going to increase it. That was level four. And it comes back that on. That might be something to look at. I, I have not looked at that. Um, I know, you know, like I said here, you can spend a day on the computer looking up uh, from a lot of companies and a lot of times the ASU tends to be bassier than the Kenwood on the stock speaker. You can see you're both in a, in a box configuration, so it's helping bring out the bass on both of them, but still the ASU tends to be bassier. Uh, and we can adjust the noise reduction level here on the Kenwood as well. When he comes back, yeah, we'll set that good. here. It's, uh, let's see here. Yeah, he should be home in a second now. We increase the noise reduction but, to maximum. Uh, yeah, I'll look. I'll Starts to clip. Look at that. That's, that's interesting. And, and, you know, a place like that, maybe, maybe bundling everything together would uh, work pretty well. But, uh, yeah, speaking of military, I was just talking Turn to my brother. Turn off the auto notch. Uh, we got out of the Marines uh, last year. After 11 years, they actually had to let him go uh, for he's got pretty severe PTSD. But uh, so I was just talking to him before I before I got on the radio. Here's the filtering narrow. Oh, it cuts him out too much a little bit, but let's wait for him to come back. We'll test that again. Testing the IF filter. You know, after spending some time talking with him, readjust isn't even the right word for it, you know. Um, I don't think he'll ever be back, you know, what to what he was before he before he went in. But uh just hope that uh, he, his life yeah, has improved a lot more than it is now. High shift and low shift he had a, a really rough time, but he was a sergeant over there in Afghanistan uh, on his last several deployments, I guess. He was in charge of a, um, a Taliban uh, little prison camp that they had out there in the desert. So he, he's seen some pretty nasty stuff out there. Now let's take a look at the AC when he comes back. You know, myself, my opinion, even if I knew that I was going to come back and never be right again, I would still do it. You know, that, but, uh, you know, I guess it, it's not for everybody, but... Here's our width control, you can see the it is. It really is. opening it up. Yeah, 
brings in a lot more bass. And we haven't shifted at all on these to help with the audio quality. I'm gonna bring some of the processing down on this yeah, as well. He's, he's actually running almost the same exact amplifier that I'm running. Um, so mine is a that, two transistors, the volume up as well. uh, running two of the BLF 2088 uh, XRs on 240 volts. Uh, his is what the Yesu has that the Kenwa does not is the contour on control on here. Uh, so he, he to be able to adjust the uh, same exact contour of the audio. It's a, well, he's running a shorter version. It's a, uh, an inset wire, but uh, he talks all over the place on that thing. Tears it up. It cuts back the audio gain, but he allows you to adjust it a little bit, turning it off here. So uh, the odds are good. So with noise reduction off, you can see how clean we can get the audio. Reducing the noise allowed it. is off. Gain control is on like on the Kenwood. Let's yeah, see. exactly. I, I believe that was probably the, the originating source. filtering shifts we've put in, but once the noise reduction is kicked in, the bassiness comes back. 